Hi, uh, this is Kung Fu Trees here, back with another Pop League. I'm playing a new deck. This is untested. Uh, it's basically a blue-black flicker list, um, except I've tried to make a lot of things cheaper. You know, it's kind of like front-loaded on one drops and two drops. Uh, you know, I'm not playing the full number of mold drifters, stuff like that. Uh, I still do have the Ghostly Flicker, Arcane Mancer, you know, Reaping the Graves engine. Uh, but I've also added Nightscape Familiar, you know, and Snaps, taking a cue from like 420 Dragon and his like Esper Familiar list. So, yeah, hopefully, hopefully, you know, compared against like the standard Blue Black Flicker, this deck will be a little bit faster. Uh, so it'll be better against hopefully like aggressive decks and it'll be better able to keep up with Blue Red Delver. Um, and compared against like 420 Dragon's uh, Esper Familiar's list, you know, that deck is also quite expensive. Uh, so hopefully, you know, this deck will also be smoother than that. Um, it's obviously, this is all untested, so it's unclear. It's unclear. Uh, but the biggest thing is, I guess, compared against Blue Red Delver. You know, so Blue Red Delver is a sh deck that, man, I struggle to, like, think of, uh, of reasons for why Blue Black Flicker would be better than Blue Red Delver. And, you know, it's a lot of it is because Blue Red Delver is just so efficient. You know, they play, like, all one drops and two drops, but those one drops and two drops are basically trading with your, like, four plus, you know, mana drops. Like, Counterspell counters whatever you play. Um, like, Fairy Miscreant is basically, you know, equivalent to your Seagate Oracle. Spellstarter is insane. You know, Ninja kind of just, like, in some cases, a better Mold Drifter. You know, it's just, like, Blur Dover is so efficient. And Ghost of Flicker doesn't actually, you know, keep up with the Fairy plus Ninja engine, I think, by itself. Uh, just because, you know, by itself, Ghostly Flicker, you make your opponent lose a card every turn, you know, in combination with Trigger Rats. You know, that's, first of all, you know, ag aggressive decks don't really care about that. And, you know, control decks are able to kind of, like, power through that. You know, like, one, they're, they're, fi they're fine losing one card per turn because they're going to be drawing more than that. Um, but, you know, kind of, uh, so I played against 420 Dragon many times, and I've won more often than not, like, way, or, way more often than not. Um, but he has gone off of me... Like plenty of times with Nice Kid Familiars and Ghostly Flicker. So, one thing that I'm hoping is that the combination of Nice Kid Familiar plus Ghostly Flicker is actually something that, you know, will be more powerful than the Fairy Ninja Engine. Um, that's a hope. Which is, you know, if you if you have Nice Kid Familiar plus Ghostly Flicker and you're Ghostly Flickering like, you know, three, four plus four times the turn, that is something that, you know, will bury opposing mid range decks and control decks. And so, that's the hope. So, basically, the hope is that the advantage of this deck compared to Blue Red Delver is the combination of these two cards, which you know may or may not hold true. Uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, so in the sideboard, there's some stuff against control, some removal spells, and some color hosers. So you know I'm gonna run this through a league, and uh, we'll see we'll see how this deck does.